Oh man, here we go, Disney World! Woo! I think for the first time in pretty much a year of daily vlogging, I got a front row spot here at Disney's Animal Kingdom. We're walking through the, the handicap right now, but we got a front row spot. Or actually, this is preferred, sorry. But we got a front row of general parking. It's clutch. As we're walking on in here to Animal Kingdom, can you guys believe that we only have three more daily vlogs left and then we're all done i hope you guys are going to be there this friday for the last daily vlog don't worry though i'm not stopping youtube i'm only stopping it periodically i'm just going to be basically reinventing myself but um what's going on everybody welcome back to another daily vlog hope you guys are having a great day we are walking in to animal kingdom on a nice very clear hot you guys it's summer again here in florida because it's hot it's like it's gonna be like 90 degrees it's pretty hot out today and really no progress updates here at the front of the park with the construction going on here with the reimagining of the front and would you look at that January 13th and Disney still has Christmas decorations up here at Animal Kingdom <sighs> I, I, at this point are they gonna be taken down Christmas I have no idea maybe they'll just keep it up for next year yep Christmas decorations are still up in full force here they are still up here at the ticket booths we're gonna go in and I don't really have too much planned I'm just really hungry and I think I want to get some food before we do something, like a ride or a show. Just a nice chill off day for me. That's what it's about right now. Just going on in and enjoying myself. <laughs> and there she is, the beautiful tree of life. Super pumped to be here actually, just cause it's so chill. That's what I love about Animal Kingdom. It's just really like relaxing and you know, I just love to walk through parks. It's really fun. There's one question I didn't ask, answer in yesterday's PO, uh, Q and A. What the heck am I talking about? Q and A, and it was if I'm gonna really kind of like miss daily vlogging, or if I'm gonna kind of like continue off YouTube for a little bit. Um, so the plan is, you know, just to kind of just like relax and reinvent myself in a way, and that's really what I'm gonna be kind of like focusing on, like focusing on myself. But it's gonna be really weird not like going to a park with a camera. So I think I'm just gonna bring the camera and vlog like anything that I really just feel like vlogging, you know. Um, Cause it's really weird, you know, try, try like leaving your phone at home. That's what it's like, like leaving my camera behind. It's really weird. But I want to see if they have any merch, brand new merch here at Animal Kingdom. I, I highly doubt it. Cause there's really not too much new merch. I guess we'll find out. I'm not really seeing much of anything here in Discover Trading Company. Oh, these sweatshirts right here are kind of new. Oh, this is new. I haven't seen this before. Nice mix shirt. How much is it? 24? 29 and these are new too. These were like kind of like released during Christmas. I really actually kind of like these But since it's warm now, I really don't really need it the purple one Green I like this one too. This is really cool as well. I like that sweatshirt nothing really new obviously they like release more merch during Christmas than like right now, but like now they're kind of like I don't even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, they have a speed tree section. Also, I guess this is kind of something to note that Discover Training Company actually has a fitting room because not a lot of shops here at Disney that sell clothes have fitting rooms, but Discover Training Company does. Holy smokes, I didn't expect the Flame Tree Barbecue to be as packed as it is. Holy macaroni sauce. I'm so hungry. The time's 11.40. Guess everyone wants to eat lunch right now. I'm gonna mobile order, cause that's the best way to do it. Mobile order when the lines are this long, guys. I actually haven't mobile ordered in a long time, just cause I really haven't really needed to. But this is definitely a mobile order situation. I'm starving and I'm gonna get something to eat. I haven't eaten anything all day. Ah, oh, it smells so good. You know what, actually, I'm gonna eat after because I wanna actually catch Finding Nemo. I haven't seen that in a while. And the next show's at 12. So we're gonna head on over to Finding Nemo. Hopefully it's not like all sold out, or not sold out. <laughs> Hopefully it's not full. We'll see, I have 20 minutes. Usually it is kinda full in the morning. We'll, we'll find out. I'm not gonna lie, Nemo is actually probably the, my least favorite show here at, at Disney in general. But I haven't seen it in forever, so I really kinda just wanna go and um, watch it, because it's been so long. There's really nothing over here to film besides trees. This walkway needs to be like rethemed, in my opinion. 12, 1, 2, 30, 3, 30, and 4, 30. They haven't even let in the fast pass. This is fast pass right now. It's 15 minutes to showtime. Oh boy. Is this fast pass? I think it is. Nope, this is standby. All right, we're in the right spot. Here we go. 
into Finding Nemo, the musical. It's kind of interesting because they put those people that right there, that we've been waiting forever, and we're kind of just like walking in the left doors. <laughs> so we kind of like just skipped like the whole standby line. Here's a look at the theater. Oh, I love the smell in here. It's been a while since I've been in here. All right, guys, here's your chance. Comment down below. What is your favorite and least favorite musical slash show here at Disney World? Comment down below. So I'm not going to lie, I did leave very, very early. I'm really hungry um, and it's just really, I don't know what about that show. I just don't, I don't like it, but I know some of you guys did, so I filmed a little bit of it for you guys. But right now I'm gonna go to the Flame Tree Barbecue because I just mobile ordered and I think it's, uh, they're preparing it right now. I'm starving and I literally love the Flame Tree Barbecue. We got the mac and cheese. We got, uh, what, what comes with mac and cheese? The pulled pork, it's really, really good. We're gonna go there right now and have some. And um, yeah, I'm so hungry, I'm so, so hungry. This is so cool, calling old cast members. If you guys mobile order, we get a, we get a pretty cool discount. I don't know how long that's valid for, but instead of $11.99, it's $10.22. Gotta save the money where you can, that's cool. I had no idea about that, I had no idea. Yikes, it seems to be very packed right now, but I'm so hungry. I love this smell over here. It smells so, so good. Oh, I love the Flame Tree Barbecue. This is probably like one of my favorites, other than Satuli Canteen. Satuli is really good as well. I don't like seeing people on their phones, because that means they're waiting for mobile orders. That means I'm a longer wait. I feel like mobile ordering has gotten even more efficient, simply because they now have someone check to make sure that you, before you get in line, that your order is ready. And I used to get in line before it was ready, and by the time I got to the front, it was already ready, and I like had like no wait time. But I still had no wait time, like literally at all. Like mobile ordering is the way to go. And here's what I got: my mac and cheese, the pork, and it comes with onions as well. This is literally amazing. I love this so, so much. This mac and cheese is obviously not really good for you, but um. Oh my god, it's so good. My mouth is just salivating right now. This is literally so good. They also have really good um, ribs here as well, but they're really expensive. The only thing that stinks about eating here is that these birds, these birds right here, have taken food from me before. So you always got to keep an eye out on these guys. They've literally hopped up on this chair and eaten my food. <laughs> I don't like those birds. That's why I don't like them. On the first bite, make sure you get some pork mixed in with the mac and cheese. It is should die for. Mm, it is so good. It's so good. Honestly, dare I say it? This pork might be better than the ribs at the Ruby Do. I don't know. I could be just saying that because I'm starving, but I think it was really good. You know, vlogging for as long as I've basically daily vlogged for, it's really kind of made me enjoy like the little things that Disney has to offer. Look at these cute little guys over here. I'm gonna zoom in up on them. Honestly, I don't even know what they're called, but they look really cute and I feel like I should know what ammo this is. Look at them, they're so cute. Like I just love walking around now and looking at every detail here at Disney because I've experienced everything big, like all the rides, but now I just wanna take it in the hole and look at Disney for what it is. Like all these tiny details, that's, that's Disney. And I just, I just literally love it. Just walking around, enjoying my time, not having a care in the world of what I'm going to be doing or rushing to. And that's what I literally love probably the most about coming to Disney, is just enjoying the park. Oh, they're lemurs. Okay. That's cute. They have a nice little enclosure here. Nice little enclosure. Do they swim? I have no idea. I feel like most of you guys probably know this, but did you guys know that it's tr the Tree of Life is an upside down oil rig? I feel like most of you guys do know this because you guys are crazy Disney fans like me. But that is an upside down oil rig. Pretty astonishing, right? I never noticed this rock right here is a walrus. You guys see it right here? See? Look at that detail. That's a walrus. I had no idea. Dang, that's so cool. It's a little crowded here today too as well. Wow. Kevin's over here now. He definitely gets his steps in for the day. So everybody, as I'm walking out of here at Animal Kingdom, we only have three more vlogs left 
and we did it for a full year. So I hope you guys come to the last daily vlog of the year. Thank you guys so, so much. We're gonna do four parks in one day where we have to ride one ride and um, keep going until we uh, finish. It's gonna be exciting, I'm really excited. And um, it's gonna be a bittersweet ending, but thank you guys so much. Um, I had a nice chill day here. And I'm looking, I'm gonna go home and edit this. And then tonight, I'm actually gonna film another vlog with Edwards. So tomorrow, you guys will see Edwards. We're gonna be going to Epcot. So thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's daily vlog. And like always, bang, bang. Ciao. Yeah.